All right, ahoy, my hees. Welcome back to this crap the way. and terrible intros. All right, so we got a lot to look yes. at here. We got a master Yaris. General, is there anything I can help you with? Has our dwarven ally arrived yet? Not yet, but we have received word that she passed the gates of kings two days ago. In other words, she will arrive soon. If you'd be willing to wait, I could arrange a conclave right after she arrives. Let me get back to you. There are some things I need to take care of first. Of course. So that one I can set up whenever. Yes. Which means I can probably come do this one first. Where's the blackboard? I want to find this blackboard that the thing's talking about. I also want to sell my crap and get some new gear. Cannot be purged, can't be silenced. You cannot silence me! Atop the mammoth stronghold of Greykeep sits King's Vantage, a gathering place of merchants, servants, and nobles alike. I hope I get to fight a dragon. From here, later. the high towers of the keep encircle the terrace, a grove of stone jutting out from the city below. Beyond, the vast country. I want to kill a dragon. Hmm. Interesting. No, I'm looking for you to buy all my junk, sir. Okay. So, you don't sell anything I can use, but do you sell anything he can use? A Guardian Flamberg? It's a two-handed sword. It's a two-handed axe. What about for her? I need a dexterity-based two-handed weapon. These are all strength-based one-handed two-handed weapons. I guess she already has one that's pretty good right now. Or I could give her dual weapons. That's always an option too. Pleasure doing business with Is there you. Like... Come again. I'm getting new wares by the next moon's turn. Attacks per second. Um. I guess it's not exactly a damage scale yet, but... This guy sells staves. Staves. However you want to say it. Oh, you can... Do I need this? I don't really want that. I don't really want that either. I don't really want any of this stuff. I'll sell all that. I'll sell these things too, because I'm not going to use those. Um. That's the heavy plate armor that I can't, you know, use now. Because I sold it to the wrong person. Are you selling the weapons that I want here? Or is these all the things that I, I've sold all those things to you at one point? Or another? Can I use any of these? I could. They just cost a lot. And they're not actually better than what I have. 20% chance to apply bleeding or 20 or 5 percent chance to apply frozen. A fair offer. Stay close. What do we have here? And who was the this is the armor dude. Armors, shields, everything from copper daggers to moon silver swords. You don't sell weapons though. <laughs> Don't lie to me. There's a dwarven merchant, so I can go look at that. There's also the new merchant, which I should go look at. Is there any point in buying any of these? Reduced attribute requirements? Not really. The shield he has is just as good as any of these ones are ever going to be. This is like the minimum requirement for her. Uh, for him, I can't buy anything because it's all weapons he can't use. But I could buy him a, a helmet. He's already got a good one. What does she have? She's got a chain helmet. So the best I could get is this. For four! Four grand! Holy crap! I get her one of these, though. You need nothing because you're doing okay. And you, I don't care about. Good until I have here. to use you. What are you going to sell, merchant? What do you need? 
This is the black one. I'm listening. Hold on. Let's check that out first. Something about a heist. A heist. I can take care of that. I can. Get up. Hmm. What's Hi, this? What you looking for? Anything for my dwarven buddy here? That's like the minimum. Which he has right now. And that would be the next step up, but uh well bargained. Well but I didn't buy anything. Axes, daggers, swords, everything for the wary traveler. You just sell dark. Pleasure doing elf business with stuff. you. Okay. Come again! I'm getting new wares by the next moon's turn. Oh I'm sure you are. What can I buy? You've got pretty decent gear all around, I think. You're doing okay. You need some more something. Possibly more defenses. Because I can't ever get you a new weapon, so... I think I will splurge just this time. Let's say, where am I? Hey, you're an adventurer, aren't you? Come take a look. I'm sure I've got something that might spark your interest. Nope. You don't have anything for me. That's the staff guy, that's the weapon guy, this is the armor guy. Axes, daggers, swords, everything for the wary traveler. Alright. We're gonna... We're gonna buy her some armor. Which one? Do I go right for the 30s? Or do I save a little bit? <laughs> it's... Honestly, you know, the gold... To save the gold is not worth it. Alright. You know how to bargain, don't you? No, there's no bargaining. It's just me paying an absurd amount of money for this. Yes. Now buy, buy the armor that I just had back. Thank you. What do I do with crab? Farewell. Down? This way. What do we have here? All right. Now that we've done it. The throne hall, the inviolable inner sanctum of Greykeep. Here lies Nortender's seat of power. The seat from which her sovereign strikes accords and passes judgment. There is a certain hush to the cavernous hall and its many passages, as if. Okay. Hmm. What's this? General. Eh. Did you hear back from the Black Company's leader yet? We still need to find information on those rogue sleepers. Not yet, but that doesn't surprise me. The man likes. I'll be going. Sure. Okay. Stay close. So, what we can do... No, we're going to... Go to, go to, go to the Howling Steps. we got two war things to do there. War war has scarred Fiara, altering the tides of power across much of the continent. In Nortender, a fragile hope for peace drives the efforts to rebuild a ravaged kingdom. A new beginning dawns for the Moorhir, as their new settlement finally takes shape, while the orcs realize the dream... There we go. So the only quest we can do inside the capital right now is the one where, yeah, proceed until Wraith has new information. I need to do the Jarus ones, and we can do these. Uh, get the crap out of get here. Ready. We'll take Yuria back. Oh, so I get to choose what I want. Eh, I'm not so much on the Dark Elves. I like the dwarves. I haven't really played a whole lot of humans. I mean, we played humans once. Yeah, let's play the humans. With autumn sun to warm your skin and a breeze on your back, the journey to the Howling Steps is surprisingly pleasant. You sleep better than you have in months, and as you arrive at the border, you feel almost rejuvenated. The clean air, the vastness, inhospitable as the steps may be, there is a certain peace to them. All the more surprising, then, as the wind carries a stench towards you as you close in on the Alian village. Well, the stench of the dead. This is one of the funniest things about recording videos is I, I realize how different I sound to myself than I do to anybody watching this. I sound like I'm constantly stuffed to you guys, but to me I sound just fine. My voice is also deeper than I think it is. 
Not very much, but just a little bit. Enough to make a difference. Let's go. Here we are. The Howling Steps. As inviting as a crypt. Is it just me, or does it smell like undead arse here? <laughs> <laughs> You're right, it does. Come on. Let's take a look around. The village is just up ahead. Uh, see that? No. The giant floating insect? What by the guardians was that? Looks like a giant horse flying a corpse at a baby. See that fog over there? I'll bet that's where the stench is coming from. Mm. This doesn't bode well if you ask me. Let's find that village. Yeah. Alright. Let's go, boys. Grab this moon silver really quick. Oh, it's not much over this time. Just the complimentary health pots, you know, knowing we're probably gonna get our arses handed to us. Who's green? Who's got green territory? Ooh, stuff. What do we have here? Free equipment. And. Hmm. Interesting. Free equipment. Now here's the here's the question. Is it any good? I mean, he loses a little bit of health, but he gains two resistances across the board. That's almost good. She can't use it. She can't use it, and I can't use it. Uh, what about the weapon? That's a two-handed great axe, a strength weapon. And she cannot use it because she needs five strength. All right, what about the bow? It's crap. So, if I took away 50 health and gave him two resistances, is that a better thing? I'm not actually sure. Eh. I think we'll pass on it for Who now. Are we killing? And... Because he always runs out of health, and I feel like having just two more resistances isn't going to change Up ahead. a crazy amount for us. Is this the wolf guard? Right Greetings. We leave. We need your help. Look, we don't mean any harm. We're here because we need your help. And we don't want your help. Yes? A staff. Zoema, what's going on here? Kayawu, blessings. The world has blessed us with outsiders again. <laughs> You're not with the bandits, are you? We're not bandits. We're from the Wolf Guard. Wolf Guard? I see. Look, if you want shelter and provisions, we can set up a tent for you outside the village walls. But you cannot enter, period. Now leave. I don't understand. Why can't we enter the village? Because our faith demands that we avoid contact with outsiders, regardless of their intentions. Though... Hmm. We only came here to talk. We promise we won't cause any trouble. How do I know you're telling the truth? You don't. Let them pass, Waremu. What? But the law... Won't help us deal with the bandits or the plague, whereas the outsiders might. Let them pass. You may restock your provisions inside. When you're done, meet me in the eastern part of the village. So basically, Stumble rob boy. them as much Fair as you enough, can. Fair enough, outsiders. Then... You may enter, but we'll be keeping an eye on you. What next? Rob them to the best of my ability, here? and then go talk about stuff. Yes? Hello, gatherer. An outsider? Oh, what blessings. Please, stay a while. Let us trade. What do you have to trade? Knowledge. Answers for answers. Oh. It is a rare opportunity to learn about the outside world. Come, ask me anything. What is your role? Well, he's a gatherer, I can tell that. Um. What do you know of the God of Light? You speak of Shergdet. I am sorry, outsider. That is a question I cannot answer. All right. I understand. Thank you. Shall we speak of something Yeah, else? sure. What, what? what do you want to know about outsiders? 
I thought the Aliani shunned the outside world. Our laws prevent many interactions with outsiders. That is true. And indeed, many of my kin want nothing to do with them. But I do not see it that way. Knowledge alone is not dangerous. It is what we do with that knowledge that matters. My curiosity is just that. Curiosity. That we should avoid something does not mean that we should not try to understand it. Somehow. I, for one, would like to know why we keep the laws that we do. That's a practical outlook. It is. And one that has earned me many frowns around here. Pragmatism and Aliani often do not mix. All right, my turn. What would you say is the worst thing about the outside world? Mm, the food. <laughs> uh, honestly, personally, social inequality, well, greed is what causes social inequality and war, but honestly, all three of these things cause all three of the other things. Um, and they all have impacts on said things. Uh, the one that ranks highest for me, though, personally, is greed. Greed makes so many issues and causes a lot of the wars and the social inequality. People are greedy. It doesn't matter if they're a king or a beggar. People always want more. Wealth, power, prestige. It's endless. Ambitions that know no bounds. I see. Very well. Go on. Your turn again. What is What's your role, role in the tribe? Are you a hunter? It says a gatherer, a but farmer? I want to know. I am one of the tribe's many gatherers. We do not farm, you see. The steps do not allow for it. So instead, the gatherers scour the land for plants and roots. That is how we survive. All right, your turn. What is your home like? Gray. Greyfell, was it? Um, I'm not actually from Greyfell. But it is an impressive city. Imagine if the outcrop your village is built upon was man-made instead. Then imagine at least a dozen more of those, and between them are a sprawling web of homes and shops. That's Greyfell. That sounds amazing. I should like to see it one day. That is, I should like to see a drawing of it, of course. Mm, it's your turn again. I've got nothing left going. for you. Ah, all right. Blessings to you then. You have you, you refuse to answer the one question I want answered, so And I saw this this chest box thing over here and I need that. Now who are you? An old You have to let this go, Takana. She's with the ancestors now. I know, but she's still out there. Well I might use that one. She deserves better. Well there's nothing that can be done. You know that. Um, actually, both of these are really good. I might end up using those. Are you alright? You're that outsider, aren't you? Just keep walking, please. Wait, Takana, Ooh, wouldn't they be able to help? You look as though you can defend yourself, outsider. I uh, suppose I can. Uh, <coughs> that's a matter of opinion. My wife, Ehina, she. She went out to gather food a week ago. I told her to stay away from that bandit camp. Oh, but dead. she insisted that's the only place you could still find berries. The bandits. They killed her. Oh. I'm sorry. I told her not to go. She of that's mercy. She deserves better than to rot on the, the steps. You didn't bury her. We never found her body. After our last search. Uh -oh. The chieftain forbade us from continuing. Is this going to be my uh, vengeful said it spirit? Was too dangerous. Well, he also said it's time to let go. You know. <sighs> I'm not restricted by your chieftain's decree. I could search for her body. You, you would do that. I'm actually a I'm nice outsider. person. You know? I have business in the valley anyway. I can keep an eye out. Oh, ancestors, bless you. You have no idea how much that means to me. Start with her campsite. It's near the bandit camp. We were in a rush when we found it, so maybe we missed something. Okay, I'll take a look. The Vanishing yeah, of Lina. Now hold on, there's a merchant. Yes? Wanna trade? 
I'm surprised you're willing to trade it. I'm going to keep that one for now. What do you sell that I can use? I can use that. Ooh, wait. Those are crossbows and bows. So, hold on. A lot of gold that I can't afford. A lot of gold that I can't afford. A crossbow is a strength weapon. I can't afford anything. <laughs> Why am I so broke? You're going to have both of those. I don't need them. Wow, that's pretty good. That would be so nice to have, actually, make running around good a little faster. Choice. That way? Why do you have a female voice when... Ready. What do you have to say? What's this? Ah, I was hoping you would stop by. You were? Why, yes. We are not allowed outsiders into the village for nearly 40 years. As such, your actions here will be recounted in our stories. Ooh. And since it's my honor to carry these stories, I was hoping to speak with you. I'd like to learn more about your people. Are there any stories you can share? Ah, you are interested in our stories. Is that the body I'm looking for? Well then, let me tell you of Kahi and the wind. Ooh. In the earliest days, the winds ravaged all lands. It shaped mountains, carved waves in the oceans. Everything bowed to it. Our people struggled to exist in such chaos until Kahi challenged the wind to a race. She held up a small stone Whoever could retrieve the stone first would be the victor. The wind, confident in its power, agreed without hesitation. But when the race began, Kahi threw the stone into the lake. Mm. Though the wind blew with the strength of a cyclone, it could not reach the bottom of the lake. Kahi dove down and retrieved the stone. Enraged, the wind howled for having been tricked, but Kahi was not moved. She commanded the wind to be calm so that our people might flourish. Still, the wind is devious, and it is said that when Kahi's spirit is not looking, it acts up and causes the storms that rage on the steps. But Kahi's spirit always returns to remind the wind of its place. That is interesting. That was an interesting story. Thanks for sharing with me. My pleasure. Right. I have to go now. As you wish. Listen for the storm. Hmm? That's me. Please be spiders. Out of the way. Please be spiders. I, no, I never want to fight me. spiders. You know it. Potion of fresh start. Now those are always nice to have. Hmm. Interesting. Leave here, outsider. No good will come from your poking around. Look, I'm not here to cause any trouble. Aren't you now? Well, what do you want, then? Uh... What's life like on the steps? Why do you want to know? There's a dose of them. I, me and my big army can conquer you. I'm, I'm just, just curious. curious. Even without those beetles, it seems like a pretty desolate place to live. Well, I won't lie. It is. Desolate, bleak, miserable. These are words I would use to describe the steps. Then why live here? Why not move? Because it is home. It is where we are connected to our ancestors. To the truth of who we are. If we were to leave, no matter the ease of survival or the pleasantness of our surroundings, there would always be something missing. We would always be longing to return. Hmm. I see. I hope you do. Truly. I kind of do. That's I'll how I feel alone, about... Then. One can only hope. That's how I kind of feel about where I live right now. Where are we going? Like, I could probably go other places. I just never want to not come back. Outsider, you found me. First of all, I hope you didn't take Zawema's distrust personally. I did. It's just, I hate that guy. Well, He's a dick. We Aliani can be quite rigid when it comes to our traditions. I noticed that. The name's General Arif, by the way. So, from what I gathered, your village is in some kind of trouble and you can use our help. Is that right? Most of my people would disagree, but yes, I think we do. It's a long ways around, I but assume I you also didn't come here without a reason, did you? That's right. We need information about a um, certain god you worship. Sheogdet? that? Ancestors, that's... That's strange. Yep. How so? Well, it's a peculiar coincidence. But I think we should save the discussions for later. 
Let me be brief. Our village is in trouble, and that plague you probably saw on your way here is only part of it. Oh. About two weeks ago, a group of bandits appeared and took over most of the valley. They've effectively cut us off from our hunting grounds, and slowly but surely, we're running out of food. Now, our chieftain went to negotiate with the bandits, hoping that they could come to some kind of agreement. Even the wise women told him that it's too dangerous, but he wouldn't listen. It's been over two hours since he left. You want to make sure he's all right? Exactly. I may be mistaken, but <laughs> yeah, yeah. you look as though you can handle yourself in a fight. Uh, sometimes. Fine. Where did your chieftain meet with these bandits? West of the village. Come, I'll show you. As long as you're not part of my my party, because I can't afford to stick another person's spells in this this party bar. Over here. I'm running out of space as it is. You there, outside. There you are. Blessings of the ancestors, outsider. Um, likewise. What do you need? Well, I heard about your arrival on the steps. You have workers, don't you? Craftsmen? Yeah. Good. I am Kao, the village architect. And I have a favor to ask of you. We are dangerously low on iron, but with everything going on, we don't have the means or the strength to collect more. And without iron, I can't keep the village from falling into disrepair. And then your people will have even more problems on their hands. Exactly. If your men could help us out, mm -hmm. I'll give you something that could be of use to you. There, I'll close that for now. There's a lot to do. All right. All right. We'll see what we can do. That's all I can ask. Thank you. We got it. Keep it up. Power of that godstone. Uh, what the? Get out of the fog, outsider. It's poisonous. I have to walk through like the stupidest little path. All right, all right, I'm going. Sounds like a plan. It's a good thing I have like sure. great health regen. Yes. How are you for stats? Oh, you're yeah. okay. In a melee fight, you'd kick my guy's ass, probably. Keep it up. Ooh, campsite. Oh, so it's true. Age doesn't just rot your old joints, but also your brains. I told you, old man, we're staying. There has to be some way we can see eye to eye. My people are starving, and... Thanks. I heard you the first time. Now I suggest you take your cane and hobble back to your village. Unless you want a reminder, huh? You cannot. <laughs> now look at those weapons. So you sheep have some fight in you after all, don't you? Careful, General. Those are purity robes. They must be fugitives. Right. Look, sir, we mean you no harm. You should put down that weapon. Oh, oh, the way that soldier is looking at me says something else. Well, here to incarcerate us, aren't you? Well, tough luck. We're not coming with you. 3,000 gold? Are you with the purity of light? You're wearing their robes. Well observed. Yes, we used to be, but that was before the god our leader prayed to turned out to be rotten. Well, terribly tragic and all, but, well, what can you do? We know better now. Hmm. That soldier is with the crown, so, unless you want grave trouble, you will tell us what you want from the Aliani. <laughs> really? You think you can flash that badge and get all high and mighty with us? Boys, I think this one needs a lesson. Get him! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Some of the dudes. Pop the heel. Shoot that one. Shoot that one. Call a taunt on those guys. Here we go. I need help over here. They got time for fed. All right, there goes nothing. Did that guy shot really quick. Pop the full ability on. And so it continues. Hey, we tried, okay? An unerring Chadango. A what? Not nearly as good as the Naginata. 
Well, it's got a higher crit chance and higher block chance, but, uh... Not unnecessary. Did you bring them here, son? Hold on. He's your son? He is. Huh. All right. Well, Kayawu said you could give us information about the deity you worship. The God of Light. Then he overstepped his bounds. There is nothing I will tell you. Ancestors, father! At least hear them out. They just saved your life. Which might not have been necessary if you hadn't shown up. But, fine. Speak. Uh-oh. So, you came here because you think we know how to kill the God of Light. Actually, any information would help. <laughs> we know nothing about it, except that it apparently wants to re-enter our world. In that case, you're best advised to leave it at that. Once Jakku has begun, there is no stopping it. Jakku? The Aliani prophecy Jakku! of the end. The eon-old pattern ensuring that one day, Sheog dead will devour us all. Uh... I respect your faith. But isn't there anything we can do to convince you? We need answers. I am sorry. And the soil shall breathe rot, soaked in poison and blood. The scrolls, verse 2. Jaku has begun, and this plague is just one of its many omens. Ugh. So regardless of what I tell you, the fate of this world is just... Go, turn around, spend time with your loved ones. Enjoy what little time you have left. Look, father. Hey, I've been a god killer I don't before. I think you're seeing the full picture. Yes, maybe Jakku is inevitable. But what about our people? If we don't find food soon, people will start dying. And the fugitives still control the parts of the valley the plague hasn't poisoned yet. If the answers we give these outsiders won't change Sis. anything anyway, why not let them help us? For the sake of our tribe. Oh, this is where I get as persuasive as your mother. Fine. Outsider, are these troops of yours that you well, mentioned large be. enough to match the fugitives? They will be if we fight smart. So that's the deal? We handle the purity in return for information? The bandits and the plague. You deal with both. And we give you your answers. Son, what? I don't know, Kayawu. My division can deal with the purity, but I don't see how we can help with the fog. You can destroy its source. The fungi. Fungi? Yes. They are what's causing mm. this. The first of them appeared some weeks ago, and wherever they grow, they rot the soil and produce this fog. We think it's their spores. The beetles came around the same time. So they probably live in some kind of symbiotic relationship. Now, if someone were to destroy the fungi, maybe the fog would... Disappear. Yes, and we know how well this worked out for Ukwe and Zama, don't we? Those fugitives are one thing. The plague is another. It's part of Jakku, and it can't be stopped. We'll see about that. All right. We can try destroying the fungi, but we'll need a way to get past the fog. Then you'll have to search for it. Maybe driving the fugitives out of the valley will give options we didn't have. That's a big maybe. I know. But I'm afraid it's all I have to offer. Fair enough. So we have a deal, Chieftain. We handle the fugitives and the plague and you give us information? Seems like my son has made the decision for me. <laughs> Fine. If you have to fail to see futility, then so be it. Let us talk about those fugitives. Okay. According to our scouts, they have four commanders. Whoa! One of them, a man named Thedric, being their leader. Apart from him, each commander is in charge of one of their camps. You should find him there. Thedric himself, on the other hand, moves around a lot, probably to ascertain everything in the camp is going to his liking. Always be on the lookout. Well, and that is all I can tell you. 
I wager that if you tear down their main encampment, the rest will flee. Good luck, General Aref. That sounded almost vaguely sarcastic. She's the fastest we have. Beetle plague, bandits, All right. prophecy. We're going to start. It can never be easy, can it? With some. What now, General? Uh, Let's get our outpost into solid shape first. I'm yeah. sure it won't be long before those bandits we have, come we'll, looking we for have stone here? Okay, we have stone here. And we're going to need some food as well. And since I have the materials for that, we'll do an upgrade. Four more workers. What do you need? What's the latest? There's a tactic to meet every challenge. And some loot. Now that I've got the three main, re main resources being built up, I should be able to... Building completed. Well, thank you. Eh, regular leather armor. To do but, what's this? Clouds gathering with the tribe, blah, 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 nothing important. I hope. I really that skimmed way? that. <laughs> I really skimmed that. All righty. You got it. More crab dung. What the heck is that? Sure. Uh oh. We go uh oh. I mean, I want this base, but. A lot of taunt. We'll do that. Pull that one out. Summon some, some, some dude man bros. You point. I'll kill. This wasn't in my contract. But you know what is in the contract? So, what's the plan? Winning. Building completed. Hmm. What's this? Can I upgrade this? No, I don't have the wood yet. But there's there's wood here, and I, I really want this place. All right, there we go. Ah, that should work. There's a dragon up there, and it's guarding some loot. You have no more free workers. Yeah, I know. Uh, we're gonna be building wood here the second we have. The woodcutters cost stone, but stone is being produced, so I don't really mind that much. Is there stone here as well? Yes. Okay. So, so stone costs wood, wood costs stone. Which we're working on, very slowly. What's the next upgrade cost? Ten wood. Uh, now we're gonna get more wood production. I can upgrade that now. Uh huh. Okay. I just don't want to go into the negatives. I want to come get this, so we're gonna go. We're gonna come get this. Hopefully, without getting slaughtered. That would be that would be very nice. I don't have the wood to make a, a stone quarry yet. So so little times. Yes. What next? Building completed. Kind of sucks that they didn't give me any troops to start with, and I have to actually build those up myself. But whatever. What can you do about it? Go ahead. This is going to be a very fair enough. Let's do this. Starting kind of. What are you roaring about? A scorching waver. Yes. All right. Let's we'll start with the bow. Give it a taunt. Give it a whack. Summon some little dudes. Pull off that one. Whack it again. Throwing your life away. Taunt it. Easy, easy money. Who are we killing? Interesting. Ooh, a wavered pelt. I don't know what I do with that. Nice, nice, nice. 
all very good stuff to have. Uh, now I can probably build the stone cutter here. And I can build a food hut here as well. Can I pull off an upgrade? We need to gather more wood, Commander. Well, once the wood is done, I'll have it. What is it? All right, we'll come this way and we'll look over this and see if this is another base I can set up for potentially more resources. Chop, chop, man. Let's get to work. And then we'll pop an upgrade on Building this completed. too, even though that's a lot of stuff. We'll be a masterpiece. Sounds like a plan. I don't have the border fortress. Requires technology mm -hmm. level three. Where are we going? Sure. Hey. Building completed. No wood, but everything else. I need the iron from this one. The outpost has been built. We've expanded our borders. I can't afford to upgrade it, yes. but. So what's the plan? Whatever, whatever. Yep. Can I get through this yet? Or is this oh. Why do the animals get to go through it? Got it. So I know this is where they can come from, so I want to I wanna be ready up here. So much to do, so little time. Yeah, 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 calm down. I wish the woodcutters could cut faster, but... She needs a lot of iron. This will be a masterpiece. How are we doing over here? Working on it. Well then. Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I can't do it. I don't have any. I don't have any iron. Ugh. So Ugh. much to do. Uh, we focus on building troops, though. Chop, That's going to be necessary. To work. This will be a master. All right. Then a billet provides shelter-free troops and thereby increases your population. Rate. Oh, so that's how you increase population for humans. Okay. I will put one up here, too. And then I can build some basic military units. I'll probably build a barracks down here, too. Where is that? So much to do. How many extra workers do I have? Four? That means I can probably put down a farm. Uh, not there. Where can I put a farm that's not in the way? Right here? Yep. That costs three workers. Building completed. And I could probably start building this place up too. I need more wood production. That's that's the most important thing, is I need wood. Okay. Uh advanced units. Building completed. Champion of the keeper. Let's take those. That's the upgrading. I'll probably need that one. This is, where's the iron? There's the iron. Well then. Wood. Wood is what I need. Well, I guess I'm building too many things to have, you know, wood be... Too easy. Cavalry warriors and champions. Okay. Uh, what do I have for... I can build a bunch of infantry then. Yeah. Some of them infantry dudes. I can finally do that. I can not build an iron smelter yet. I'll probably need that soonish. They've got griffins. I'll need some griffins. But I also need archers. Our provisions are running low. We need more food. 
Yep, you'll be producing food. Don't worry. Wood. More wood is needed. What is it? Chop, chop, man. Let's get to work. Literally, chop, chop. Cut me some wood. This is the masterpiece. Oh, there we go. All right, then, let's get to it. We're being attacked. Oh, the scout. Well, then. I don't know what I'm going to be using that for. Uh, can I build, yeah, make some food production, and I still don't have the, ah, uh, there we go. Where's the stone? Here's the stone. Can I upgrade this one more time? Once I had the wood for it, I can. Oh, there's another dragon. Take a second. Not even. Oh, there's a base up here with Arya. What's Arya? Ooh. So much to walk by. Kettle hat of focus. You got fours. You got fives. You got sixes. I can use it then, let's get to it. That looks so dumb. I'll keep the hood, thanks. That's me. Over here. Look, the aesthetic over the two Sounds like a plan. bonus is not worth it. Oh crap. I didn't need to do that. I still need iron. Uh I could build a couple more archers. Uh, a couple more soldiers. Swordsman. The swordsman. And I can finally do that for extra workers. Chop chop man. Let's get to work. This. Only to the <gasps> yes? Okay, where was that dragon? Can I go fight the dragon? And go collect this place? But there's no wood here. I don't care about getting that place. There's no wood. Alrighty. Okay, as soon as those Let's troops are finished, we'll go, uh, we'll go march on this place and hopefully take their wood supply. Sure. I guess. Elf, hand over your provisions. Just what I needed. Take them down. Uh oh. Scouts! I'm not too worried about scouts, but still. Some of the boys. Skelebros. They must be done. I'll keep the bastards off you. Cool. What's this? That looks like a big shield. Please be spiders. A 20% block chance shield, but it looks awesome. So that's why we're going to put it on. Like, look at that crap. You... You killed them! There was no other choice. It was you or them. You're right. We should probably be grateful. Who are you? Chieftain Mayawa sent me. I'm here to deal with the plague and the bandits. Will you be all right? Ancestors willing, we might be. Before you go, here, take this. It's not much, but it's the least I can do. I don't know what else to say, outsider. It's obvious that there will be bloodshed. I 
just hope there won't be much. Did he give me something that I'm not aware of yet? Out of the way. Oh, they've got a base here. All right, all right, I'm going. Is this the Over here. to fight this way? Get ready. Oh, you'll get a good return on your investment. Go ahead. Oh, I'm just pressing the wrong one. Hold on. What's the latest? This has now. Yellow Bros, shoot it again, hit it with the axe. Give it a taunt just in case. There we go. Take the wavering pelt. General? That way? There we go again. Does that mean there's something up here worth getting? Ooh, yes, there is. This looks like the campsite take on I mentioned. Hmm, no sign of a body. The campfire, though. It looks like someone was here recently. Yeah. The embers haven't gone cold. Maybe they'll be back later. We can deal with those bandits in the meantime. They might know more. Red looks better on me. All right. Now we can come back. This uh, will be a masterpiece. Over here? Hopefully they don't come through this area, because I'm not ready for that. We have a hunting cabin. We got the stone being produced. Can I build the iron smeltery here? Yeah. Holy crap, I do not have the workers made for that. Let me take a second. This will be a masterpiece. But you know what? Whatever. Troops are being finished? Yeah, right. Did you say something? Forward! Now! Attack! I should probably get some catapults, you know? Where is that thing? Yes. Do you want to build me some catapults? I'm hoping there's uh, wood in this sector. It doesn't look like there is. No, just food. You come out. Yes. And iron, though. Iron's good. Come out. Yeah! I'm gonna send you to get up there, cause uh. They won't know what hit them. Commander. No, 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 no! Get up here and shoot these guys. Knock. Hey, fire. Team, why are you so far behind? Holy crap! Yes. Move in. Finally, some action. Let's murder them. These champions are crazy. This is it. This wasn't in my contract. The outpost has been built. We've expanded our borders. I'm literally doing this so I have a better chance of, uh, <clears throat> of building units a little further up. I'm ready. Building completed. I do need more troops though. What is this? An unholy altar? Ugh. Uh. We get some more dudes. So much to do. Fodder units, you know, always good. We get some more arbalists. Building completed. Move in. All right, all right, I'm going. Okay, uh, what can we build up here really quick? 
Some elite units? Yeah, that sounds pretty nice. Chop, chop, man. Let's get to work. And the regular barracks. Where's that? <clears throat> Although there's still some, there's still some uh, iron here, so I should probably should probably do that. Building completed. Ugh. What do you need? What next? Holy crap! Holy crap, there's so many of them! Uh, we'll kill that guy. Everybody get back. Sure. <clears throat> Academy's working. Did you say something? Yeah, you wanna come shoot this thing? Building completed. Okay, so we got the iron mine. Uh who's got extra oh, workers that aren't being work. used right now? You've got one. Well then. You've got one. You've got zero. What's All the right. hunting cabin's full? Building here? completed. Chop, chop, man. Let's get to work. Oh right, I can. I was gonna do this. I can build a citadel here in their town. I can't get any of these things. I get mentalists. And flag bearers. I don't have any aria being produced. Actually, I need to come here and get that. Uh, so that being said, where's the barracks I had over here? Produce me some of your finest troops. We'll get uh, ten of those. We get eight of those, and we get a couple Our catapults. Our smiths need more iron. We got a single catapult, I mean. These guys got four workers available, so that means I can do that. And... So much to do. So little time. The food is no longer needed here. So I can build the forge. Ah, that should work. And two workers. Well, Why can I put two workers on? Wanna take a second? Nothing really. Can I produce more billets really quick? Uh, I don't have enough wood. More wood is needed. This will be a masterpiece. So much to do. All right, then let's get to that. Should work. Okay, okay, things are going all right today, thus far. Need scouting? <laughs> yeah, you're, you're building crap. completed. So you're finished being upgraded, which means now I can finally build... I can't build griffins, because griffins require a blueprint that I don't have. I don't have any aria, which means I need to get some of that. I don't have any aria starks. But I can make these all into border fortresses now. Which definitely helps We need me. to gather more wood, Commander. Well then gather more wood, guys! Ugh! Commander. Of course. Hit them where it hurts. We'll be swift. Open fire. Oh no, a squad of a squad of scouts. Building the horror. Completed.
They've got so many scouts. Hit them where it hurts. They've got the true fodder units, I guess. So if you guys are doing that, I can build another barracks up here for the sake of... I'm still making three more. Oh, that's good. That means I gotta put a farm down. Or I could put a hut down, a game hut down, yeah. And that'll get me more food for more troops. Oh, this looks like a wooded area? Yes! What? That's what I need. I need... More wood is needed. How are we doing down here? We still making catapults? Building completed. I can actually finish this quest now. Building completed. That's me. All right, I need all of you to come up here. To all this. Right. Give me a second. Uh, we're gonna need. Sure, let's get that. We're, we're being producing... attacked. Attacked by what? Nothing important, apparently. Uh, we get some more troops. Our population troops. is at maximum capacity. Okay. We need to expand. I'm working on it. It takes so much to get there. I'm listening. Just what I needed. I'm coming for you. Building completed. Iron smeltery cost reduction? Great, that would have been helpful quite a while ago. Oh, and we've got that stuff too. Our population is at maximum capacity. We need to expand. Hold on, hold on. I'll do it. Just give me like two seconds. Our population is at maximum capacity. We need to expand. <laughs> Shut up! Okay, I'm working on it. I also need you guys to make more wood, but I can't make more wood because you guys are taking all my freaking wood. All right, woodcutter. Uh, get to get to cutting. I'm ready. That worked okay. And then I can start producing more iron here. Yes. What is it? Just give the word. Okay. Okay. Everything's going all right. This will be amazing. Okay, build another one of these stupid little houses because my population will not expand any farther. Without it, these Building things. completed. Uh, I want to start making aria production, distillery. That's the closest I can get to it. Building completed. And then probably another. I'm gonna get this to the border fortress for the extra workers. We need to gather more wood, Commander. Yeah, I'm aware of what you need. I'm aware you need to shut up and start working. And then I can make. All right, then let's get to it. Well, that seems pretty good. Um. Where's the quarry? Where's the quarry? Building completed. And after that, I still have four dudes, and four dudes means. Oh, that's a cannon. For now. That's your command. No, no. Do not go up there. Heading out. Building completed. 
you, you guys are going to stay on defensive formation. We won't move a muscle. Well, you'll move some muscles because you got to fight back. Otherwise, you're going to die. Uh, and we'll build work. another one of these. Even though my wood production is extremely be a masterpiece. low right now. All right. She's ready to fire. They're in for a surprise. take as much land as possible and then we're gonna go march on the capital what does this do building completed what does the unholy altar do chop chop man let's get to I'll put another one in for good measure. All right, then let's get to it. Border fortress having five extra guys. <laughs> well, then you can start making me extra smelter. Uh, you don't have any of that. No point. How about a farm? Produce me more food. This is a masterpiece. <clears throat> well then. Building completed. No raw meat left in what sector? This one? Okay. Demolish that. Aye, that should work. And then with the extra workers I have, I can put all of you on. Do 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 do. This will be a masterpiece. Um. I can put three of you on a farm, that's for sure. I can make another house. Two. What? They won't know what hit them. Yeah, we'll come get this iron and this food. Is this done yet? What about this unholy altar? Is that done yet? What do you need? Yeah. All righty. Hmm? Building completed. Iron is scarce, so that quest is complete. Awesome. We'll pop into that as soon as we get this place. Yes. Stop shooting me. Stay close. What next? Can you, you guys it. stop it? Why did you run through enemy territory? Is, is my question. Is there something to fight this way? My catapult. Would you like to push for a change? What's the latest? One step closer to victory. The outpost has been built. We've expanded our borders. Yes, we have. I'm ready. You're ready, am I ready? We're being attacked! There's no godstones near that! I gotta get my troops up there, like now. There's a lot that's under attack. You guys are idiots. Commander. Open fire. Ready. We've got so many dudes. Sounds like a plan. You got it. Here we go. Yeah. Did you say something? What is it? Yes! Yes! What? I...
I'm ready. Knock! Aim! Fire! What? Hey, Hit them where we're, it gonna, hurts. we're gonna walk all the way up there, Good you idea. idiots. That's me. We're going all the way in. Commander. No, 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 that's not what I wanted to do. Did you say okay, something? Now we're going back out. Because I didn't want to that fight way? that fight in the first sure. place. And you guys, for some reason, decided that's what we're doing. Our smiths need more iron. Okay, we'll go do some of that. We'll throw a bunch of these guys in there. <clears throat> well, if anything good came out of that, it's the fact that they killed a lot of my units, and therefore I've got a lot more space now. I'm listening. Where to? Oh, oh, that's that's really good. Good. Blaze, yes. Taunt that bitch. Let's go on that one. Oh, give me some skeleton bros up here. Do what we kill. This is it. Kill that one guy just because. We wipe him. Yes. Honestly, I could just fight them right here and just win the war because of this, but... I'm not going to. What does this do? Take my food. I don't know what this unholy altar does, but I'm going to feed it food and find out. He's ready to fire. Can build some of these guys now. I don't know what those guys do, but that sounds cool. Everybody will come up here. Oh, we're almost out of raw food here. That's good. That means I can put them on something else. Since I'm, you know, I feel like that's the wrong way to do that. I'm gonna go more of those, more of these. So much to do, so little time. We'll add another house over here for more population. Maybe, uh, maybe another one right up here. Oh, well, I forgot that I own this place now. Suddenly, I have unholy revenants as my units. Well, I mean, sure, I guess. Building completed. We finished researching a new technology. Attack now! For the Falcon! We got a lot of guys up here. That's good. Um. You got four dudes being unused right now because my hunting cabin is now gone. Um, the trading of resources 
Excuse me? I didn't even know that was a thing. What is it? Well, I, I want you guys to come up here for free XP, but that's Attack! just about it. Because all of you seem incapable of... time finishing thoughts. Just realize that. I haven't even got to see their griffins. Some kind of fortified area farther up north. We should make sure there's no one there to surprise us. Right. I saw that too. Let's take a look. Move! you happen to be in their fortress because they forced us to look i know how it sounds but those bandits the purity they were fucking insane we have no idea what we were in for when we signed that contract your mercenaries from wolfgar yeah when that tahar started kicking the purity's butt they reached out to us and hired us and our beasts to defend them beasts yes we're beast tamers Whatever the creature, I, I can get it, tame it, and train it for battle. Ooh. Wolfgar Griffins, Loranian Scarabai, Empyrean Falcons, we, you name it. Obviously, it didn't take us long to realize that we were fighting on the wrong side. Torture camps, iron masks, impalements. No matter the pay, there's, there's a line you don't cross. Very true. Problem was, that nut job who led our division, Thedric, he just wouldn't let us go. Even after the fucking wars were over, he threatened to impale us too if we ever thought about turning heel. And now we're here, in this godforsaken wasteland. So, you want us to spare you? Yes. Now that Thedric and the other lunatics are dead, we, we can finally call it quits. Please, I know this might sound like I'm trying to talk my way out, but it's the truth. We didn't want this. Wait, you said you tame griffins? Uh, among other creatures, yes. But we even have some with us. Then this might be just what we need to destroy those fungi, General. The fog couldn't harm them. Funga. Oh, you're planning to take care of that plague. Yes, absolutely. We could help with that. And in return, you let us go. Uh, yeah. How sure are you your griffins can destroy the fungi? Pretty sure. Well, you'll have to protect them from the beetles while they're at it. But what your friend said is true. They're too high up in the air for the fog to harm them. All right. Fine. We have a deal. But don't even think about crossing us. Oh, count on it. Thanks, friend. That really means something. Come, I'll show you the beasts. That's me. Hold on. There's there's stuff to get first. This will be a masterpiece. A book forged by ice. And some gold. And gold's always important. And oh my god. That's a dexterity weapon. Hell yeah! Target is big. Increased damage. Nice. Reinforced medium plate armor. You don't have the constitution for that. Nobody has the constitution that except him, but he can't use it by a dwarf. Ah, oh, of course. All right, all right, I'm going. Woo, Griffins! Here we go. There, there, boy. These are friends. All right. Let's see where we're at, shall we? 
I guess you know already that it's not the beetles causing the fog, but those fungi. They corrupt whatever they grow on. Which means, who would have thought, that you have to destroy all the fungi on a patch of land to clear it from fog and rot. The beetles feed off the shroom spores, so they protect them like their own eggs. However, going on a mushroom purge alone won't do the trick. One of my scouts found out that they're all connected to a kind of a mother shroom in the east. As long as that fat, nasty old lady keeps breathing her spores, the fungi in the areas you clear will simply pop right back up after a while. In other words, clear the sector where Mama Fungus grows, build an outpost, and have your workers shredded to pieces. And presto, fog, beetles, and fungi go back to the dank place they came from. It won't be easy, though, as you can expect the beetles to defend their symbionts. You need to make sure they don't get the better of whatever flying unit you send to destroy the shrooms. Griffins, purity, fungal fog. Not what I'd have expected from this mission. You're telling me. Good choice about pardoning them, by the way. That man definitely wasn't a saint, but I think he was being genuine. I know. Let's see what those flying creatures can do. The sooner we get rid of the fungi, the sooner we can get our answers. Yes. All right, so first things first. Ooh, combat okay. balloon. Let's get to work. Just give the word. Well, see, so these guys command. are useless in this particular fight. Unless Heading the undead out. can't be hurt by that, uh, by the poison. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go hand in that quest, and then I'll call it a, uh, I'll call it a mission. Ready. I'll call it, call it an episode. Yep. Ancestors' blessings, outsider. We managed to find some ore for you. Our workers will have it delivered by sundown. You do? That's great. Wait. Let me go get those scrolls for you. Here you go. What do you think? Can you make use of this? Definitely. Many thanks. I have to thank you. Ancestors' blessings. What did you give me? I get one. The cost reduction for the forge. I'm probably going to be using humans for the most of this. I'm not biased. I'm not biased. I just... I'm a human. Didn't I build... a... forge somewhere? There it is. Whoa. Here we go. Oh, that costs so much crap. But it makes all the guys way better. All right. So we're going to call it there. Uh, thanks so much for watching. If you do and when you do. I know you're going to because, I mean, frankly, look at me. I'm awesome like that. And I would love to see you in the next Conquest. So long.